Messy, not so aesthetic, but super yummy yogurt bowl. We have granola, we have walnuts, we have chia seeds, we have hazelnut butter and banana and soy yogurt. <laughs> Good morning guys and welcome to or welcome back to my YouTube channel. So I just made a yogurt bowl consisting of the things I just told you. For breakfast i did my stretches did my journaling did my meditation so we're off to a good start today i'm gonna go for a run and it's an editing day so it's a productive slash fit and active day in my life so yeah basically the plan is to eat and then maybe get some editing done while i'm digesting the food and then one or two hours go for a run and have obviously a post run shake and edit some more basically my whole day just consists of running and editing and maybe going for a nice walk or whatever so very productive <laughs> and i thought i'd take you along with it so i'm gonna have my breakfast now i'm listening to a podcast been back in the podcast game which is i think i'm gonna do that on my run too because i feel like when i'm running and i'm listening to music i start running out way too fast and then when i'm listening to a podcast or i'm running with someone and we're having a conversation i can run way longer because i don't start out running super fast so i'm gonna listen to the podcast while running um hopefully that will help so i'm gonna just finish up breakfast and then i'll see you when i do my pre-run stretches okay i am gonna go for a run i made some braids or I braided some braids <laughs> um, because I think this is really cute for running. So I'm about to do some pre-run stretches. Uh, this is really important. And then I'm gonna go, it's raining outside, but it doesn't matter. We're gonna go anyway, no, no excuses. So far, I've just edited some videos. I was pretty productive so far. <laughs> this person's very cool. Guys. Like and subscribe and Patreon or whatever. I don't have a Patreon. Oh, okay. He's very sweet. Um, he's very sweet. The weather outside, like I said, is not that good, but we're not gonna let that stop us. We're still gonna go. My goal is 5k as always. If I do 6k, that's great. Um, if I only do 4k, that's okay. And after that, I plan on um, training my waist a little bit and doing like a little bit of a waist workout because I feel like whenever I train abs, I train like the mid and lower abs really well, but my waist is kind of, I don't know, I don't train it enough. So we're gonna do that and then have a shake and keep editing and hopefully be able to upload a YouTube video today or tomorrow or at least on Monday. I still have, don't have a thumbnail, but we're gonna work on that as well. So let's go, let's stretch, and I need to find a podcast to listen to. And I'm hoping these headphones are water resistant. So let's figure it out. Let's get out there and let's run. <sighs> I'm scared. By the way, this is my go-to running outfit is this sweater that I got thrifted, plus just any sort of Gymshark pants and yeah, usually like a sports bra or whatever. This is my go-to running outfit, so.
I'm back from the run. I am going to make with my beloved Nutribullet a post-run shake, protein shake. And I'm gonna probably add banana, spinach, mango, protein powder, water, maybe some yogurt, just like a green smoothie. And then for tonight, I plan on having some vegan curry, which I'm really excited about. I have to see if I have all the ingredients, but I should. And it is currently 2.30, so we are on track, actually, um, because I'm gonna finish the video and do a couple other things, maybe get some groceries. And yeah, I'm actually ahead of time with everything I wanted to do. So that is great. So I'm gonna make this smoothie right now. I will show you and then just relax for a little bit. I did Mary Braun's 10 minute waist workout. I can only recommend my abs were burning the entire time. So I still like to do home workouts, I'm finding a flow between the gym, home workouts, running, but yeah, I ran 5K, so that's almost four miles. I think 5.4K, and this was the first time that I ran 5K by myself without stopping. Um, so I my pace was like 10 miles, but like I don't really care about that as long as I just do the run, and I didn't stop, which is great. Um, I'm not too tired, so I didn't want to be too, too tired because I have, yeah, other things I want to do today but I'm still very proud of myself for completing that run. So let's make the shake. I'm so excited, I'm hungry. And then get to work. powder stuck but like look how green it is looks so nice let's fill it into the glass very thick I could have made this a bowl too like you can have this as a bowl or as a shake but today I was feeling like a shake wow look at how green it is wow and this is post running mmm wow this is a good shake. I have a reel posted on Instagram where I make this bowl. You should go check it out. You should follow me on Instagram actually. Bye. And then the little like dot thing, not dot thing. Okay, I have it linked in my description and I have it linked somewhere on YouTube. You should follow me on Instagram. Bye, Sarah XX. By the way, when I'm working or when I'm doing anything, I always have my almost two liter water bottle with me. So motivating. I'm currently editing a vlog, so things are going well. And this, yeah, this water bottle with the straw, it literally like motivates me to drink a lot more water. I don't always, cause I get up at like nine-ish, like between eight and nine right now. So I don't, like listen to this strictly but I definitely drink like one and a half of these like every day and I've noticed a difference for sure so keep hydrated and drink your water just as a little side reminder guys I actually made it I edited the video that I've been putting off for so long <laughs> and I just edited it within a few hours also I took the braids out and I'm quite feeling these curls Yay, these are all natural, just from the braids. Such a productive day. I should just film productive day videos often so that I always have a productive day. But of course, I didn't have, it's a Saturday, so I didn't have anything else going on. And I had pre-filmed a lot, so that really helps, of course. But still, I'm happy with how the day progressed, even though it's very gloomy and rainy outside today and I can't see the sun anywhere. <laughs>
Okay, quickly showing you just making some basmati rice. And then we have carrots, peppers, coconut milk, chickpeas. You can add other vegetables if you want. Um, coconut milk, like I said, curry powder, paprika powder, some date syrup for sweetening. It just enhances like the flavor. Some salt and I think that's it. Yeah, you saw everything that I put in there. So now I'm gonna basically bring this to a boil and then let it sit for like 10 minutes. And then I'm gonna add some coconut yogurt to it and then that's our dinner. Okay, so my curry is ready. So we have the rice and we have the curry sauce, a little bit runny. And then I added some coconut yogurt. So I'm gonna have that now. And then I think I'm gonna edit a the thumbnail. So my workplace for the day. And yeah, that's basically it. I'm not sure if I'm gonna do anything else where I can take you along with me today. Like nothing interesting. I'm basically just gonna have dinner and edit the thumbnail and I don't know, maybe post some pictures, whatever. Very casual, easy Saturday night. And then later I'm gonna have like a Zoom call with a friend and hang with my partner. So that's all I'm gonna do for today. Thank you so much for watching and motivating me to make this video. I feel like my day was extremely productive and chill at the same time. I hope that it could motivate you to get some movement in, make yourself a nice meal or work on something that you've put off or something like that and yeah i hope that i will see you again soon in the next video so until then have a great time bye